big news in the world of physics. MIT just rocked the science world with a discovery that could change how we store information forever. So what's the buzz? It's called P-wave magnetism. And it's not your ordinary fridge magnet kind of stuff. Let me break it down. Traditional magnets, like the ones holding up your vacation photos, are ferromagnets. That means all their electrons spin the same way, creating a strong magnetic field. Anti-ferromagnets, on the other hand, have electrons that spin in opposite directions, so their magnetic fields cancel each other out. No sticking to your fridge door. But MIT researchers have found something in between. They created a new form of magnetism, P-wave magnetism, inside a material called nickel iodide. Picture a super thin crystal flake, just a few nanometers thick, where the electrons line up in a spiral. Imagine tiny spinning tops forming left-handed or right-handed spirals. Depending on the spiral's direction, you can actually switch these spins around just by applying a small electric field. Why does that matter? Because it's the secret sauce behind spintronics. Instead of using electrons charges like regular electronics do, spintronics harnesses the electron spins. That means computers and phones could someday store way more data using way less power. Think five orders of magnitude, less energy. The MIT team showed they could flip these spin spirals by zapping them with a small voltage. They even used circularly polarized light to prove the P-wave behavior existed, seeing electron spins match the direction of the light. There's a catch though. Right now, this effect only happens at ultra-cold temperatures, about 60 Kelvin, which is even colder than liquid nitrogen. For real-world tech, scientists need to find a material that pulls off this trick at room temperature. Let's analyze what this means. If researchers crack that code, we could see a new generation of non-volatile memory chips. Think lightning fast, tiny, and energy efficient. Say goodbye to overheating laptops and massive server farms draining power. And because Spintronics works by moving spins, not charges, it could cut down on waste heat, making electronics not just faster, but greener too. In conclusion, MIT's P-Wave magnetism discovery is a massive leap toward the future of computing. It's still early days. Room temperature applications are a big hurdle, but the potential is huge. We're talking about ultra-fast, super-dense memory that barely sips power. Stay tuned, because the way we use computers could be about to change in a big way. Thanks for tuning in, and if you love hearing about breakthroughs like this, don't forget to hit subscribe.